General Fitness Training, Wikipedia Audio General Fitness Training works towards broad goals of overall health and well-being, rather than narrow goals of sport competition, larger muscles, or concerns over appearance. A regular moderate workout regimen and healthy diet can improve general appearance markers of good health such as muscle tone, healthy skin, hair, and nails, while preventing age or lifestyle-related reductions in health and the series of heart and organ failures that accompany inactivity and poor diet. Diet itself helps to increase calorie burning by boosting metabolism a process further enhanced while gaining more lean muscle. An aerobic exercise program can burn fat and increase the metabolic rate. General fitness training may be used to promote weight loss. Personal trainers construct a program centered on restructuring lifestyle while helping to provide the necessary motivation for its success. Weight loss and muscle definition General fitness training can also be used to promote toning or building of muscles, which are essentially the same physiological process. Sports-specific trainers can help improve strength, flexibility, and stamina to improve performance in specific sports. Options include increasing arm strength for tennis playing or improve strength and core stability providing better balance playing golf. Sports-specific training is all about developing physical conditions to improve performance and skills at a particular sport. Also, understanding the needs of the game, training slash practicing at the correct pace, in order to meet sports requirements. Certified personal trainers can contribute significantly and uniquely to recovery and rehabilitation efforts. But personal trainers mainly pick up where physical therapy leaves off. During a pregnancy period a lot of stress is put on the muscle on the lower back due to the heavy weight being carried. Exercise and stretching can be extremely important to increase strength and reinforce the body structure for the extra weight. During the second trimester the unpleasant symptoms from the first trimester should have settled down and the mother will start to feel a renewed level of energy. The biggest change during this period will be the growth of the bump. As the baby grows the mother should notice a change in her body position and posture. The extra weight occurs at the front of the body, the hip and back joints will take the strain. The posture will shift as the lower back muscles tighten and take an exaggerated curvature. The abdominal muscles will stretch and strain to adapt to the growing baby. During this time it will be extremely beneficial to perform exercises to help strengthen weakened abdominal and pelvic floor muscles, in order to reduce the strain on the lower back. More Specialized Fitness Training Sports-specific training Injury recovery Pre-slash-postnatal trainer